Oh, what happened, little kitty? Why so scared? Well, are you sure it is a real ghost? In that case, let us see what science has to say about these paranormal entities and answer a spooky, creepy question. Are ghosts real? Zoom in! Every year as Halloween approaches, the question of ghost existence slowly creeps its way out like a dead body walking out of its grave in a horror film. These filmy ghosts can be as friendly as Casper or as menacing as Annabelle. And if you think many of these stories are based on actual events, then you aren't alone as many cultures since the dawn of humanity have believed in spirits that survive death and live amongst us until their desires are fulfilled. And it is because of this core belief in ghosts' existence that people have tried to communicate with spirits since ancient times through various mediums like Uji bones, crystal balls and what not. Even in modern times, you'll find ghost hunting groups using high-tech technology to debunk this mystery. Typical equipment might include Geiger counters, electromagnetic field detectors, infrared cameras and super sensitive microphones. Most of these gadgets are used to detect any unexplained light, radiation or noise in the environment where a potential ghost could be present. But the vital question is, what does science say about ghosts? Do experts approve of the evidence given by Ghostbusters? Well, the answer is nope. Despite the use of such high-tech gear, there are still no scientifically verified cases of ghost detection. Even all the videos floating around the internet turn out to be either staged or misinterpreted. I know what you are thinking. Then, what about the personal ghostly experiences you hear from people around you? Well, according to science, you can't always trust your eyes, ears or brain as they might be playing tricks on you. Yes, that is because your brain has a tough job of taking the tons of information coming from your five senses and working to make sense of this mess. And though our brain is good at understanding this task, however, it is so obsessed with it that it starts to find meaning even in meaningless things like seeing faces in unusual patterns or other figures in clouds. This phenomena is known as pareidolia. Not only that, I'm sure at times you felt your phone ring just to find no call or notification. Or a time you heard someone calling your name when no one was there. Such events are nothing but hallucinations, a false perception of sensory experiences. Some hallucinations can be normal like hearing a phone ring, but more vivid ones like often seeing ghostly creatures or deceased loved ones may be a sign of a serious disorder. Another less worrying condition in which someone can hear or feel figures or creatures that aren't real is called sleep paralysis, which happens when the brain messes up the process of falling asleep or waking. We have already covered sleep paralysis in detail. Please check it out afterward. So in conclusion, according to science, ghosts do not exist and are a result 
of experiences such as sleep paralysis, hallucinations or pareidolia. But what do you think? Ghosts really don't exist or we simply do not have the technology to detect them. Trivia time! Did you know a poll found that 46% of Americans say that they truly believe in ghosts? Also, the word ghost comes from an old English word gust, which means spirit or soul. Hope you learned something new today. Until next time, it's me, Dr. Binox, zooming out. Phew, never mind.